Well, the coroner has heard evidence substandard work was carried out on a fishing boat that later sank, leading to the deaths of two young deckhands. The mother of one victim, who's never been found, hopes the inquest will finally provide some answers. It's been four and a half years since Patty Hellier lost her son. 28-year-old Justin was never found after the commercial fishing boat he was on was swamped and sunk off Stansbury in August 2008. I just want to know exactly on that day what happened to him. His heartbroken mum may finally now get the answers she's been longing for. Tomorrow, the inquest into the death of Justin and mate Adam Nikolai will hear from skipper Andrew Pisani. It will be the first time the only survivor of the fateful day has spoken publicly. This morning, the court heard evidence from Howard Peachy, a naval architect with the transport department. He examined the six and a half metre boat after it was pulled from the bottom of Gulf St Vincent. He found the addition of a net reel decreased the vessel's stability and authorities should have been notified. We would have been concerned if we had learned there was a net reel put on it. Mr Peachy also highlighted other concerns with the boat. He described the standard of the work done to the electrics and other fittings as poor and amateurish. It was not good boat building and marine practice. Will MacDonald, Nine News.